Dear students, hello. Welcome to our new tutorial in assembly drawing. Now we we'll go to put some reference balloons to our assembly. After we assemble it, we'll make a bill of material. In order to do so, we have to go to annotate tab to the bomb bill of material panel and here we have bill of material we'll click this bill of material and it will ask us to create a set current we'll click on our border and this is our parts are here we have hexagonal head bolt hexagonal washer and because we repeat our assembly the quantities are not equal here so we'll change them to two and I'll change hexagonal head bolt to two we have two hexagonal head bolts and two washers and it's true here we have two bushes and one body and one cap we can renumber our items here he gives the number one to bush number two to body number three to cap four hexagonal knot five hexagonal hit bolt and six washer we can reorder them too but first let us do some balloons and we arrange and edit for our part list here is a balloons we click just click this bottom and come near to our part and it will show us it will be highlighted and show the cap we'll click here hit enter if we so and switch off our ortho and we'll put it somewhere here hit enter you give it number three as we saw this is our body click enter put it here click enter number two and we'll go to our bolt here hit enter click enter number five and we'll go to our knot enter here's our knot enter and to washer this is our washer enter and we'll put it somewhere here enter we can arrange it after so this is my six parts if you go down it will be the same this is my body enter and we'll give it a number and etc you can go for a cap here enter this is my cap in the top view this is my washer at the top view enter you can see it gives the same numbers I'll hit enter now and apply for my balloons I'll go to my part list this is my part list and we have a description we don't have a name so we can click here right click insert column to the left and we'll choose the name click and this is our names are ready here we'll arrange my part list I'll take number one click and drag down three I'll drag and drag after two and this is one two three I'll go back and take number four here after three and I'll take number six to the end so I arrange my numbers one two three four five six my num my quantity we have two 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 and we have one cap one body and one bush this is my standards here that I choose them 
here we can write the part list name and we'll name it as shaft bracket bracket assembly I'll choose some settings here settings I don't need this yellow color for the text in my part list so I'll change it to white you can change the height of the font if you uh, would like you can change the style of the header here we took one, my style you can change it you can put another style as you wish now we'll keep it for it as now and you click OK apply OK and he'll ask me where to put my part list I'll put it somewhere here now there's no place so I'll put it somewhere here for, and click OK close and I'll make a space to my part list and get home click move and move all of these I'll hit enter I'll take them a little bit to the right again move I'll move my part list from here I'll put it at the corner here and as we can see this is item numbers one two three four five six this is my quantity and this is my name description etc I'll double click here and enable column split insert title we need our title to be shown click OK and this is our title now shaft bracket assembly and this is my parts this way we come to end of our tutorial in working drawing and precisely in assembly drawing hope you enjoy and understand what we did thank you for joining us and goodbye